Hello everybody, Luke here and welcome back to the channel. So as you guys probably know, I've been working on, on a lot of painted circuits recently. And recently I thought of bringing the implementation of an Arduino to it. So this is what I've done, this is the first painted circuit that I've done with an Arduino. And it looks pretty cool! <laughs> so what's actually happening here? Well, what I've done is I've got four LEDs and they're on 300 millisecond delays in between each other. So it goes in a line like boom, 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 as you can see. <laughs> well, I'm going to bring the camera closer anyway, so you can have a closer look at what's going on here, because it is pretty cool. So I'll see you guys in a second. So here you go, this is what it actually looks like up close. <laughs> it looks really cool because it's just going from LED to LED and it looks like it's going bloop. Bloop, <laughs> which is pretty cool. So what I've actually done here is there's only five jumper leads connected and there's obviously a positive up here and your negative down here. And the positive literally only has one jumper lead which is connected from the ground onto here, which then calms down and branches off into four, which is pretty cool. And it comes down, down here like this, as you can see. And this is your negative. So I've also got four more jumper leads connected into these points, which is connected to pins 13, 12, 11, and 10. Which is pretty cool. So I'm gonna put the sketch in the description and I'm gonna take a picture of this and put it up on screen right now. Just so you guys can have a closer look. So this has been really cool, but this is only a stepping stone into what I really want to do. So at the moment I've been working on mood lighting picture frames or something along the lines of that. And that's why I did the potentiometer videos. It's because I want to be able to control these LEDs in a picture frame, maybe doing some sort of sequence like this with dimmable brightness, which would be pretty cool. <laughs> so I'm gonna move the camera back up and I'll, I'll see you guys in a second. So even though this is a little bit basic in terms of circuitry, it's still really cool about how it actually works, which is what I find pretty cool about it anyway. <laughs> but like I said guys, the sketch will be in the description. And anyway guys, that was a closer look on what's actually happening here. So like I said, I'll put the sketch in the description. So if you guys wanted to recreate something like this, you easily can, no problems. <laughs> And yeah, well I think that brings me to the end of the video anyway. It's only a little quick update to show you what I've actually been getting up, up to. Uh, <laughs> and yeah, like I said, this is pretty cool. So anyway guys, I hope you found that quite interesting. And if you did, leave a comment, maybe even like the video. <laughs> Any feedback as well is also appreciated. So anyway guys, I hope you have a good day and I'll see you later.